Today, we are going to discuss the cost of college. Estimating the cost of college education should take into consideration your expenses as well as the sources of financial aid that are available to help pay for these ed educational expenses. The expenses include tuition and fees, and that's the cost of taking classes or courses at your school. Room and board, that's the cost of food or meal plan and housing. Books and supplies. The cost of textbooks and course materials needed. Transportation and other, that's the cost of gas, entertainment, eating out, laundry, etc. Financial aid. Scholarships, that's money given based on talents, grades, or other circumstances. Common scholarships include educational scholarships as well as athletic scholarships. Grants, that's also money given. And it's usually based on a student's financial need. Work study, that's money students earn by working at jobs provided by the college. They might work at their college library, for example. Loans, that's money borrowed, which must be repaid, usually with interest. Describe the main difference between loans and the other forms of financial aid listed above. So loans, you must repay. Whereas the other um, financial aid is money that you're either, that you are given or are, that you earn through work and you don't have to repay that. The table below lists the estimated expenses for one year that Leo and his two friends will have at the schools they want to attend. Complete the table by totaling each person's annual expenses. So Leo at the four-year university, again this table represents cost per year. If we total this up, that's going to equal $19,400. For Kate, she attends a four-year private university, and the total per year is going to be 40300 Ben attends a two-year community college. He's also living at home to save some expenses, and that's gonna cost a total of $6,600 per year. Leo qualifies for a total of $6,200 in scholarships and grants per year, and he will earn $2,700 each year through a work-study program. Including financial aid, what should Leo estimate the cost per year to be? So he, um, it's going to cost him $19,000, $19,400 per year. But then he also has this $6,200 scholarship and the $2,700 grant. No, the work study program. And that's a total of $8,900 that he has per year. So we could take that away from his yearly cost. And that's going to be $10,500 he still has to pay. Including financial aid, what should Leo estimate the cost of four years to be? So we're going to take that number per year that he has to pay for, and he's going to multiply that by four to get a total of 42000 Leo's family can save $175 each month for the next two years. How much can his family pay towards Leo's first year of college expenses? Well, if this is how much they can save each month, monthly. Two years, if I multiply that by 12, that's 24 months. So $175 per month times the 24 months. And that's going to give us a total of $4,200. D, if Leo has four years to save the amount he needs for his first year of college, how much should he save each month? So we can take away from the total he needs for the four years. Um, so for the first year of college, it's gonna cost him 10,500 extra dollars he still needs 
but his family's saving four thousand two hundred per year, or to go towards his first year rather, and that equals six thousand three hundred dollars. He still has to pay for his first year of college. He has four years to save. We want to know how much he needs to save each month. Well, there's forty-eight months within the four years, so we could divide. Divide this by the 48 months. And that's going to be a total of $131.25 per month he needs to save in order to earn the $6,300 he still needs to pay for college. All right, you try um, these next few problems with Leo and Kate, and you can check, or we did Leo, you can solve for Kate and Ben. Numbers two and three, and then you could check the key on Canvas. Also work out number four. I'm gonna do with y'all number five and six. Number five, Julia's family wants to save for her four-year college education. After some research, they estimate that the total cost for a state school will be about $72,000. They have saved 35,000 so far, and Julia is 14 years old. If her family saves $300 a month for the next four years, how many dollars will Julia need in financial aid to pay for all four years of her education? So first, it's going to cost $72,000. And she's already saved the $35,000, so we could subtract to find the difference. She still needs $37,000. Now she's going to save for the next four years. Times the 12 months, that's 48 months. So next we could multiply $300 a month times 48 months. And that'll give a total of 14,400. All right, and this is the total cost of all four years. This is how much she's going to save for the next four years. So to see how much left is needed to pay, we can subtract to find the difference. And we're gonna get $22,600. All right, next. Jeffrey is a senior in high school. That's our final answer. You can put right there if you want. Jeffrey is a senior in high school and he estimates that he will need to contribute $7,000 each year towards his college education. Jeffrey has one year to save enough for his first year. Complete the table to show how much Jeffrey should save each month based on how much he might already have in savings in order to meet his goal. So he needs to contribute $7,000 each year. $7,000 each year. And we're going to divide by 12 to figure out how many months. First year, he's gonna save for one year, that's 12 months. If we divide by the 12, we're gonna get $583.33. Now, if he already has $1,000 saved, we can take that away from the $7,000 he needs. So in that case, he would only need $6,000. Divide that into the 12 months in the year he can save to get $500. If he's already saved $2,500, take that away from $7,000. To get $4,500 left, divide it by the 12 months, to get $375. And last, if he already has $5,000 saved, if we take that away from $7,000, that's only $2,000 left to save. Divide by 12, and the monthly savings amount would be about $166.67. Solve the remaining problems and check with the key on camera. 